Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today's video is a speed build, technically. I mean like, I'm calling it a speed build because I want to call it a speed build because <laughs> I just said because like 300 times, but we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> I want to call it a speed build. It's technically for my Let's Renovate Sunset Valley because I mentioned this briefly in the Jamie Jolina makeover, but I'm gonna build also like I'm gonna fill all of the lots and stuff with Sims and all that stuff, you know? Um, I, I hope you know what I mean. So today I made a starter home. I'm calling it a starter home. I'm really sorry because it's technically not a starter home, but starter homes are so cheap in The Sims. I'm sorry, but how are you supposed to make a pretty looking house with 600,500 simoleons? That's not enough. 600? I meant 16,000. Yeah, 16,500 simoleons. So this house is actually under 22,500 which is like the max budget for like eight sims even though it's a one sim apartment in my mind i think it'd be fine if you cheated but i promise you i'll make cheaper starter homes but this is kind of like a more expensive starter it was a practice run i guess i don't know but yeah it's for let's renovate sunset valley so like i'm calling it a speed build but it's also for let's renovate sunset valley so it's more of like a part of that but it's a speed build but it's in the sims 3 and um i'm really happy with the way it came out i kind of like branched out a little bit when I was doing it. It was like, I don't usually make greenhouses, especially this green color. It's, it's different. Um, I also like the interior is kind of like a green and purpley, like, uh, green and purple sounds really bad, but it, it was, it's like almost like a peachy purple, if that makes any sense. You'll see when you get in there. It's more purple than any peach, but it's, you'll see. It's kind of, peachy i don't know it's pretty that's all i can say is it's a pretty interior i actually think i'd like the um interior better than the exterior the exterior is just a little different for my taste i don't i don't love it <laughs> it's it's all right i don't know i don't really love the color just like watching me build it back kind of like adds to it um yeah also another thing technically the roof is custom content but i couldn't bear the base game roofs so i added a custom content roof and now, I know I said I was going to do CC free, and yes, the Frio Brother house is CC in it, but um, the Frio Brother house was a mess of its own. Like, that that's something different. <laughs> I hated the Frio Brother house, and I do with a passion. It Not only am I not super proud of the way it came out, but I hate doing huge houses like that. That's never a house I would ever want to do, and I hate doing huge houses. I love doing little small houses, so that's why I built a starter home in the first place but anyways i'm getting off track um i i technically used a custom gunnet roof but you can easily replace a roof color with a like a darker roof color i just thought that the custom content one looked a little bit better so i used it because i had it you know so like if you were to get this into your game and like i said in the last one i don't even know if i'm gonna have this available because i don't even know if i'm gonna be able to like i'm gonna like learn how to upload a town but like say i do you download this, you're going to have to replace the roof with a regular black one. I don't think it's that big of a deal, and I'm sorry if you do. <laughs> the Frio Brother house, I'm sorry, truly sorry about that one, because objects are literally going to be missing. And it's just... <sighs> I like building with just the base game. Like, it's actually not that challenging. Although, I do kind of want to get more store stuff, because I do feel, like, kind of limited when it comes to, like, couches and stuff like especially i don't know that sounds weird but they're like i have my favorite couches in the sims 3 like i have my go-to couches and i don't want to overuse them i also have them in the sims 4 i don't know couches i'm picky about couches like i don't like the way a lot of couches look but like i so i use the same one um so it feels like there's not that many couches in the game because there's not that many couches that i like in the game so i don't know i'm picky i guess <laughs> Yeah, because there's a lot of couches in The Sims 4. It's just I feel like I ha I use the same ones over and over again because I only like the same ones. <sighs> I don't know. I feel like some couches just aren't realistic. Like, would you really have this, like, bright orange, weirdly shaped? I don't know. There There's some weird couches in The Sims 4, and I feel like would you really have that in your house? I don't know. I, I guess I'm just... I, I'm particular about my couches, I guess. <laughs> I, I was... I was gonna say I feel like we need more cabinets too, but we really don't. I mean, like in The Sims 3, the cabinets are kind of limited, but I think it's just mainly my lack of ability to come up with a countertop like 
um, cabinet countertop color scheme that goes together. Um, I really do think it's my, because I go, I have the same go-tos that I always do. It's either like a, like a orangey wood countertop with a, a white base counter, um, a marble countertop with a darker underneath base, like a darker wood, uh, or like a white one with a darker wood. It's so hard to not to do anything else and I see other people do other stuff and it looks really pretty and maybe I should just look at more inspiration pictures because coming up with them off the top of my head I could not do. Um that's just nope, not 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 the way my brain works. Not at all. <laughs> Props to the people that literally come up with stuff right on the spot. Like I when I'm building, I don't actually usually use a reference photo. Um I usually get it all from my brain. Um but I do, I, I do, like, I have seen things before, you know what I'm saying? Like, I've watched Sim speed builds, and I've looked at, like, home design magazines and all that stuff, and, like, TV shows, so, like, I, I see stuff from that, but, like, I guess a lot of people see that stuff, so maybe nobody comes up with, I mean, obviously nobody comes up with stuff off the top of their head, because you can't do that, that's not the way people work, um, I mean, you may think you came up came up with it off the top of your head, but you really didn't. Um, but I'm I'm not gonna get into that. I could like rant about that. Um, it's really not like a oh people think they come up with stuff type of thing. It's just a I realized it one day and like it just makes so much sense if you think about it. I mean like we didn't come up with anything just off the top of our head. We like we put two and two things together. Like we may have come up with like, I guess you could come up with color schemes. I guess that doesn't really fit into my point. Because, like, I mean, like, think about it. You didn't come up with the marble countertops or the, like, the wood. You put them together. And, y you know, that's what I'm saying where no idea is original. Like, completely original. You you mushed things together. It's like mi mixing and matching things you already know. That's that's basically what ideas are. Um, so that's what I'm saying. So I guess you could come up with color schemes on your own. But, like, I suck at color schemes. So, you know, that's, that's, yeah. I'm horrible at, I, 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 I have my, like, regular color schemes. I love blue, especially in The Sims 3. I think blue in The Sims 3 is really good. I like green quite a bit in The Sims 4. Like, when I mean quite a bit, I mean, like, I use the same green siding on <laughs> my Sims houses all the time. It's like that teal green. I use that literally all the time on all of my houses. Like, go back and there's at least three that have that coloring on them. And if I didn't actually post the speed builds, I definitely made them. I don't know. I, I like that color a lot, and I try and branch out, but um, that's another thing. I, I feel like we don't have a lot of Sims 4 walls, like, paneling, like, outside of the house paneling. Maybe I'm not creative enough. I feel like that's probably it. I'm probably just not creative enough, and, like, I'm using the same two. But I don't know. There, There's only one that, like, really, really I like a lot. There's, I guess that some of the blue ones are decent, but I really like that one, like, tealish green one. Especially since it goes so nicely with the bricks. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what that was. That's, that's, that's all I'm gonna leave it at. Um, I'm sorry if you guys haven't really liked how many speed builds I'm doing lately. I just, I like speed build, I like speed building. That's what I was about to say. I like building in The Sims and I've just been super into it lately. Like I've just, I really felt like building and I may have started another build the night I'm doing this voiceover. So you're probably going to see that one soon. Although you're going to see a cast soon because I have a, I have a, a planned cast in my head for within the next few days and you'll hopefully see my generations let's play so like hopefully you'll see a little bit um more <laughs> uh than just speed builds but you're gonna see a lot because ever since i re like rebooted not rebooted because i was only gone for like two or three weeks um but like you know ever since i've started to get like really back into youtube again I just, I've been doing, I've just felt like building so much. I just, I like building, all right? I'm a builder in The Sims. I'm sorry. Um, maybe you guys like it. I feel like you guys like my speed builds. Tell me if you don't like them, please. Actually, please don't. Just tell me if you do like them. Actually, you know what? You have the freedom to say whatever you want. In the comments, tell me whatever you want about my builds. I don't care. Um, <laughs> tell me if they're terrible. Don't tell me if they're terrible. But tell me if you want, like, more of a variety in my, my, my videos yeah that's what i was trying to say 
Alright, so it is getting to the end of this video. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, everybody.